Hello. What are we doing today, Gran? We're piecing your quilt together. You've done all these wonderful hexagons and we're making it into a lovely quilt. Yep, that's right. So I've um, tried English paper piecing for the first time. I've stitched together 56 uh, florets or flowers and um, we're going to Gran with her expert colour eye or eye for colour um, is going to uh, help me to arrange them in a pleasing way and then we're going to take lots of photos and I might even number the back of the pieces because um, there's got paper templates in them so that I remember when I'm stitching all of them together over a very long period of time. We could just pin them. Yeah we could but I'm not sure if I've got a space in my house big enough to keep them pinned. And it doesn't matter you can just fold it. Oh yeah okay we'll see Gran's full of good ideas so that's why we'll I'm here we'll for see. some advice um, so we'll check in a little bit later and show you the layout we end up with okay okay Uh, so first we have um, put the hexagon flowers into rough colour groupings so that when we're looking for a particular colour we know which pile to go to. And they're not even piles, um, so there's going to be much more, for example, pinks than there are rainbow or orange. Um, but that's okay, it's um, intentionally a scrappy quilt with lots of different patterns and colours and designs in it, so we'll see what the overall effect is soon. Okay, Floss fans, um, we've had a couple of false starts so far in that figuring out which orientation, oh, nearly tripped over, hopefully I didn't make you feel sick, um, figuring out which orientation to put the hexagons in was a bit tricky, but then we consulted Robin from the Strawberry Thief's wonderful videos and we think we've got a plan now. I'm also planning to, I've laid out a sheet here, as you can see, I'm planning to pin them to the sheet like a makeshift design wall, but on the floor. Um, so Granny's lent me this sheet, thankfully. So we're going to try again. This is many, many, many hours later. <laughs> <laughs> How are you feeling, Granny? I'm tired. Me too. But we've made great progress. Yeah. Um, I'll flip the camera around in a moment and show you the progress. Found out that I don't have enough hexagons with this layout. We're missing a couple in the middle, single ones to fill in some gaps. And also I need to make a decision about the edges because I could either fill in the edges with some single hexagons or I could put a solid border around it. So I'm not going to rush it because um, these You've things plenty take of time. time. Plenty of time to make your mind about it. That's right. Study it for a while first. Yeah. Um, so yeah, I'm going to put it away and then get it out again and have another look at the layout in a few days time. <laughs> 